Hmm, Adidas, Louis Vuitton, Jordan, clickbait. Finally, something fabulous! Do you think it's fabulous? I think it's so fabulous. Your vote's the one that counts. Yep. He's good. What is going on guys? Today we are back and today I hope you guys are all having a great day. Kind of dusty, actually. Good thing these new Tanner Brungard long sleeve hooded shirts are perfect for dusting off your camera. Today it got super cold in Kansas. It's actually like freezing. It snowed in the north part of Kansas. I live in like the bottom right of the state. Let's take a Snapchat, see how cold it is. 46 degrees. You guys just saw me jumping into my pool the other day and now it's like this. That's the only way I can describe Kansas. Completely random in weather. We have days where I'm wearing shorts even though I wear shorts all the time. Then I have to wear a coat the next day because it's snowing. But yeah, I hope you guys are all having a great day. I would take my truck today, but it still won't start. I have to get an all new battery for it. The battery simply just died forever. And we tried to start it, tried to jump start it. Would not work. I think the most fun option is gonna be this one. Plus, you know, the, the shirt. My mom should be coming out. I'm going to drop her off because she needs to pick up her truck. It was getting worked on, apparently. I don't know why she just doesn't buy a new one right now because she has the opportunity, like, before it gets really cold. And she just asked me if I have a charger in my car. And the only charger is for me because that's how I play my music. So she's gonna have to use the frunk. Oh God, I forgot you're still in there. Kind of scared me. There you go. Be in this car. Since she's taking forever and making me sit out here in the cold. Uh. <laughs> I don't know why my mom's so afraid of babies. I mean, she had three of them. You'd think she wouldn't mind. Bye everybody! Oh dear. Don't hurt me, I'm just a baby. I hate that thing, can I burn it now? No, you can't burn it. My mom just asked me if she could burn a child. Your phone will not be accessible throughout this ride. Then we can talk. We're jamming out, Mom. We're jamming out. Listen to this new song. It's actually just came out. By who? Bye, have fun. Bye, can you open your thingy? Oh, my frunk? Yeah, of course. She can't see me because of the tent. Are you going straight to Grandma's from here? Probably. Yeah, I think Tristan and Taylor are joining you. Okay. So. Bye, I love you too. So yeah, the plan for today that I haven't spoke about is, where's my seatbelt? We're gonna go to my grandma's house, and that's all I have. All I know is that it's pretty fun there, and I like my grandparents, and she has a cute dog, cookies, I mean, what else could you want? So I'm gonna awkwardly drive my car through Kansas. And yes, I listened to Nickelback in 2017, they're still good. for me at the door. Oh, there's Gracie. Hi, Gracie. Did Tristan not beat me? I haven't seen him what yet. What the heck? Watch out, Gracie. Come on, Gracie. Watch out. Grandpa's out here beating the cold. I was gonna say the heat. It's not hot. You're lucky you got a fur coat, you old rascal. Oh. Hey, Jeez. you finally made it. Oh, Did you mess with my sour spray? No, what? I swear to God. The dog is my favorite dog in the history. Yes. I shouldn't say that. We have two dogs. <laughs> Come here. Come here. Come here. Come here. Jump down. She's afraid to. Hey, hey, now look, she'll get on my back and then we'll do. Oh, crap. <laughs> she should jump Come on, get up. Don't take my sour yeah, spray. Hold on, Gracie. She's on my butt. Free back massage from the little dog. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, I just realized Gracie's collar. Wait, come here. Come here. Quit running in circles. It's almost the same color as my shirt. Look, there. She's too hairy, but there it is. And then boom. Ready to go cut wood? Let's go. All of Grandpa's bees are inside their homes in their box because it's way too cold outside. You got a little bit of a honeycomb thing. Yeah. <laughs> Is that where they just, yeah, you can see one right there. Yeah. Focus. Oh, yeah. oh. You need something about you, baby. Whatever you get, I can handle. I'll break that if you want me to. So is the machine you have for it here? Yeah. We're doing it the manly way, not with the machine. This hoodie's gonna give me the strength. Whoa! That felt like hitting a rock with a baseball bat in the middle of winter. You gonna do it? <laughs> I'm good. So here's all the wood that we already have for winter. Well, day, but I'll still be joining you next to the fireplace because that's like the best spot ever. But I'm learning about wood. The orange ones burn longer. Thank you for the lesson. Before we go back inside, we're gonna take a peek at the bees. Since it's cold, we don't think that they'll come out and sting us. But uh, yeah, we have no gear. Oh, that's a big spider. Holy crap. 
<laughs> oh, there's one. There's some. See? Yeah, they're already coming out. Yep. A few of them getting some fresh air. So, for anyone wondering about my grandpa's car, he got the whole front end torn off and he just ordered a fender for the front. Uh, new fenders for the front. New inner fenders. Well, as soon as it's completely done and all fancy, then we'll finally race. <laughs> race, huh? You might win because your car might scare me with the sound, <laughs> and then I'll just quit. My lord, look at it shine right now. Holy crap. It looks so gold right now. Like, some light, it'll be gold, and then some, it'll be, like, pink. You can literally see a perfect reflection of the sky and the trees, and oh my god. I call the back seat. We're all piling in the van, going to eat a nice family meal at this place called the triangle not the square not the rectangle dude i've not been in here forever my head can almost touch the ceiling there's always a little blanket right there to keep us cozy we'd always hide in there and then she'd be like oh where are they and i'd be like yeah. i'd film in here but it's old-fashioned people and it'd be awkward so tristan please cover the lens that was quick that was easy thank you <laughs> i'm very oh, efficient just... Do not put that in. Wait, what'd you do? I just like shot snot out of my nose. <laughs> now put your hands on the lens and take it back off. Hey, that was Bye. fast. Where we're leaving, I got a toothpick. Okay, goodbye, Gracie. Goodbye. Bye. Oh, you're riding home with me and not Tristan? Yeah. I got a brand new song for you, you ready? Why do I have a feeling it's gonna be bass boosted, pumped up kicks? <laughs> <laughs> I haven't told you guys about this, but I got this star projector because I told my mom one day, hey, I want the universe on my ceiling. And then we were going to do like this weird Pinterest project thing, and then we realized, hey, that's that's a lot of work. We realized we're not crafty people. Yeah, so we got this projector. It's like a little ball. Plug it in, start it up. Let's see if it makes... Hit the lights, boy. Come on, focus it. It's almost there. I feel like it should be a little bit more clear, but it's getting close. We'll get it figured out to where it's all fancy, but for now, we're going to do the weekly Q&A once Dylan gets here, so... 10 hours. Okay, guys, sorry about the mess, but it is time for the weekly Q&A. That is not weekly. I'm Dylan is here with me, 17th Steven, the first. And before we get started, if you guys want to be involved in the weekly Q&As, go follow me on Twitter, at Brungart Tanner, and you might as well go follow the 17th Steven. Yeah. Where do you see yourself in 30 years? Will you still be making YouTube videos or do you have other plans for the future? You wanna go first? My kids will probably be almost adults. <laughs> oh yeah, true. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, true. I'll be, I'll be 47, almost 48. <laughs> yeah, I wanna have kids for sure. Um, I have no idea. I might still be making YouTube videos. I might be an actor. I might be uh, working at <laughs> a f***ing McDonald's. I don't know. I bet I could only act in comedies. That's yeah, yeah. I, can do. I know. Will this ever actually become weekly? See, the thing is, whenever I film like half a vlog and I'm like, you know, I just want to answer questions for the rest. That's when I do these weekly Q&As. And then there's other weeks that I have like a jam-packed week full of good stuff that I want to be on the vlog, so then I just don't do it. So, who knows. Have you ever been to Wisconsin? No. Is the picture Dylan tweeted of him earlier today photoshopped? It's actually not. I just put it through like three different filters. Yeah, Everyone's... that's what everyone does though. If you haven't seen it, there it is. Oh God, thank you for that. Um, Are you going to go back to California? And yes, I actually am going to be going back to California. I'm pretty sure it's within like a week. I'm going to be meeting someone really special. He's not a YouTuber. Really? Yeah, do you know who that is? Yeah, That's why? Crazy. I don't know, he just wanted to meet up. If you're asking if I'm gonna move back to California, I see myself living here at home for at least another year, uh, hanging out with friends, you cute ass, mm. and making videos like that, like my old videos, and I want to not just all of a sudden just hop up and move to California. I wanna make like slow trips out there, make sure all of my fans and everybody, like you guys, uh, love the vlogs out there just as much. Until I'm 18 and an actual adult, and my mom can handle me being away, like I'll probably just stay here. I feel like if I ever move to California, it'll be like, Alone. What is the meaning of life? Uh, I don't fucking know. Can we put on some dramatic music here? Um, I believe the meaning of life is to make an impact on the world and the society that's been built in a positive way with whatever talent you were given and make people smile and whatever talent you have, use it for good, whether it be making people forget their sadness and present their best selves to you or make a scientific discovery, make a business, a brand, something, but don't do something as selfish. Now you fucking have it, bro. Will you ever go out of the country? Um, yeah, I still haven't left the country. I'm weird. Neither have I. I I'm just scared that I'm gonna have a horrible anxiety attack and basically I, just not be able to handle it be being scary. that far away, long flight, and I just don't know if I can do it, which is, sounds like a, a baby and stuff, but, and I don't really have a reason, so. Until then, life of a teenage dad coming soon? Well, I'm single now. Um, I could have a, uh, surrogate. A surrogate? Surrogate. Whatever the <laughs> f*** it is. Are you today's date because you're 10 yeah, out of 10. 10? I saw that one. I, I saw that one on uh, my, uh... That's pretty good. I'm gonna give you a like. Why did you drop out of school? Oh, there's a thumbnail title right there. Alright, let me do a serious face. 
So I didn't really drop out of school. Uh, I basically satisfactorily completed high school, which is basically like I didn't, I don't know, it was weird. But I have a little mini diploma to prove it. And I guess my mom just wanted me to do that as a backup, but I don't really see myself doing anything that would need a, an education. I'm way too motivated in my life and way too like crazy. Like I'm, I'm gonna do big things, like no matter what, that's just me. At least this moment in my life, I know that it doesn't matter wh whether or not I have one. Uh, I don't think that if you don't have a plan, you should drop out. Maybe that's probably not the best idea. <laughs> But I know for me that I don't have any like regrets not finishing high school. I didn't get to go to prom. Ah! I had to kill. <laughs> Favorite big time rush member? Obviously Kindle. Kindle. Definitely Kindle. I haven't met the other ones. I used to love James just because I was jealous of how sexy he was. I was jealous of all of them, if we're being honest. But Kendall's just the nicest, coolest guy ever. I love his music. Go check him out. <gasps> Heffron Drive. Someone asked me why I followed them on Twitter. Well, I don't know. I guess I'll unfollow you. I'm kidding. I do still follow you guys back on Twitter, by the way. Uh, whenever I get the chance, I'll go through and I'll just randomly follow you guys because I like to surprise you and make your day. I think I'm following like 5,000 people or something ridiculous. So. Will Tanner Squared and Dylan Squared ever occur at the same time in a vid? Like, oh. we have the worst timing ever. I know. Stuff. No, we every went, time. We I went to California three times before I met Dylan Hawk. Like, I would go there and he wouldn't be there and then he'd be back. I think that it will happen. I just need to take you to California again. Who won? Rice gum or iDubs? I didn't watch any of the videos. I just like iDubs better. <laughs> yeah, I think iDubs is literally a human meme and I think he's hilarious. I don't know who won. It's not really my decision, man. I don't know if we did it. Do you think we did it? I think we did it. I think we did it. But yeah, we're going to go ahead and end this video here, and I hope you guys enjoyed it, and thank you guys so much for watching. And don't forget to leave a like and share with your friends if you enjoyed. Subscribe if you're new, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Peace out. We're doing it. Peace.